Now then, my friends, in today's vlog, boy, have I got a treat for you. This one's going to be a bit embarrassing, actually, because we've got DJ Dazzler himself right here doing? on his Ducati. I've only got my mobile phone, by the way. Here's his Ducati. Let me turn the camera around because I've got my Super 73. And we're going to take you on a little journey through London and then we're going to have a bite to eat. I'm not sure what I'm going to eat yet because it's a little bit late for breakfast. Uh, but we'll have a look. We're going to a place called Half Cup. Yeah, so. Half Cup. Question is cup half full or half empty? There you go. Comments down below. But check the bikes out. So I've got my Super 73 electric bike. And uh, it's a Super 73 electric bike versus a Ducati. Well, uh, I think we might know who wins that one, although it is only 20 mile an hour through London. Uh, just check it out. Mine, mine needs a wash. <laughs> I got caught in the rain the other day. So, if you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Subscribe to this guy as well. He'll be up here somewhere. Uh, and also at the end. Well, you, you, you've got a thing about going at the end, so we'll put you up there. Well, because not many people stay till the end. They do on my channel. Oh, well. Because <laughs> I always put them little out bits. Anyway. But I'm up there as well. He's up there as well and on the end. Anyway, we're going to head over there now. I'm going to be on the Super 73. Stay with us because we've got the 360 camera, so you'll see a little bit of footage of London as well. And I'm starving, so can we get going? Yeah. Come on, let's go. Right, here we are. Oh, oh, I can hear you now, that's it. <laughs> How are you? Right, half cup, literally was only half a mile away. Easy catching up with the, the Ducati, I have to say. Um, however, I'm glad we're not in a race, that's all I'm saying anyway. We'll take a look inside, have a look outside, look at the menu and have a bite to eat, and then uh, we'll catch up in a minute.
So, I know it isn't breakfast time, but you may be watching this at breakfast time. So I'm gonna order the breakfast for those who uh, are watching it at breakfast time. And if you're not watching it at breakfast time, then it's the equivalent of an all day breakfast. So it's called the half cup uh, and it's smoked bacon, roast tomato, portobello mushroom, hash browns, controversial, beans, fried egg, and sourdough. No sausages. Again, controversial. However, it does look a lovely breakfast. Uh, and I'm going to hand you over now to DJ, who's going to tell us what he's had. Mine's an easy one. I'm having scrambled egg on toast. I'll just fancy it. Because uh, the Mac Master can show you their, their version of the full English. So I can have a little scrambled egg on the side. different coffee shops and they do them patterns on the top there must be a training course surely because they're quite impressive I don't know how they do them you should see what they actually put on the top of the coffees in Mansfield <laughs> family channel <laughs> it's good coffee <laughs> Right, my friends, so this looks, I have to say, excellent uh, on first uh, impressions. Uh, they've got the egg almost there. I did ask them to baste it over the top. Um, DJ will tell you why it's very difficult. I think it's on a grill, isn't it? Uh, they've done this on a grill, but they've done the best on that one. Uh, got a nice bread there as well. Got the beans separate. Uh, got two ash browns, got the tomatoes, got the mushroom, which is cut in half, and the bacon, which looks nice as well. Uh, I'm going to hand you over to DJ and he can, um, be, well, first, it's, well, I'm going to dig in in a minute. Is it so far, so so good. Um, uh, I'll have now I'm all right at the moment, thank you. Before we go any further, my friends, just take a closer look yourselves. And remember, you are marking this out at 10 as well. Right, well, before I dig in and uh, let you know what it's like, I'm going to hand you over to DJ because he sort of like pulled a face like a ooh and then said something about his, uh, his scrambled egg on toast there. Yeah, he missed the face. He missed the face. Um, probably the best scrambled egg I've had. That's, I mean, I know you score it at the end, but when you know, you know, and that's off the charts. Um, right. So we're going for this uh, very quickly uh, before I dig in because I just want to eat this. The egg, absolutely spot on actually, I've got to say. Uh, hash browns, not greasy. They look nice, hash browns. Not a catering hash brown you get, that you normally get. Um, that's nice, not greasy at all. And we're going for the bacon there. Looks a good quality bacon. They did have sausage on the menu, by the way. Uh, before, because uh, Darren asked them, they've just changed it, that's all. They changed the menu. That's a nice bacon. Wow. Yeah, that is good. And again, proper bread, none of that uh, cheap bread. Go in for this. Yeah. That's a quality breakfast. Got the tomatoes. Now, I've said this before, some people like tin tomatoes, some, some people like these. It's all down to your personal preference. But what I don't like is when you get these tomatoes, the real ones, that they don't cook them through. Wow, yeah. See, that's nice, perfectly cooked. Right, I'm gonna eat these. We're going for the beans, but I'm, as soon as I'm with Darren. Nice bean, but I ain't got a clue what make it is. So there we go. Bean gate. Beans of beans. <laughs> I'll see you guys in a minute.
said to him, get yourself a tripod. He went, oh, I don't need one, I've got you. It's a family channel. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think he understood what he said there, did he? <laughs> or maybe he did. Tell you what, that was spot on. Let me have a, another coffee, a little drink, and we'll sum this up. And uh, I mean, DJ's, we already know, is off the charts, but I'd like, his, I'd like his verdict on the looks of this, though. So we'll see you guys in a minute. Right, this is going to be interesting. By the way, that's the smallest spoon in the world. It literally it only just sticks out the top of there. Bit odd. Anyway, we digress. So, my friends, the bill has come to £40. And you're all right. So right, I'm just getting the bike in. <laughs> 40 pounds. In the comment section down below, by the way, which bike would you add? Would you have the Super 73 RX, which is over there, the electric bike, <laughs> or would you have the Ducati? <laughs> yeah. Answers on a postcard. <laughs> anyway, back to, back to the bill. 40 pounds and 26 pence. Uh, that was, we did have an extra latte and extra coffee there as well. Uh, that includes a 10% service charge. Controversial, my friends. However, we are in London. Um, you kind of expect it in London and New York, etc. Uh, they started in Mansfield now as well, which is a little odd, but there we go. Anyway, moving swiftly on. The breakfast itself. I'm gonna be interested on Darren John's uh, verdict on this one. For me, absolutely spot on. However, is missing a sausage. I did say to him, missing a sausage. Uh, and they said, we'll look into that one for you. So, the missing sausage. <laughs> He's shaking his head. It's probably the name of the vlog. We could name it the missing sausage. Um, hide the sausage. It's a family channel, be careful. Um, so, all in all, it's not a full English. However, quality wise, and I'm not gonna mark it as if it's a full English because I knew it didn't have a sausage. I have to give it a 10 because of the quality of ingredients. And I know you're gonna say it's missing fried bread, it's missing black pudding, it's not a full English. I'm not calling it a full English, it isn't a full English, it's a breakfast. Uh, and it's their spin on a breakfast, and I thoroughly enjoyed it. The, uh, the, the, the hash browns were not greasy, the egg was not snotty, so the bread was lovely, um, the beans were nice, I'd say they were Heinz, but what do I know? Uh, <laughs> everything about it, spot on, coffee nice, Staff were nice, really good. I'd highly recommend it if you're in London. It's great, you can just people watch. Now I'm gonna hand you over to DJ himself and we'll give his verdict. Um, it, it looked really good. I, I will say, I'm not a fan of streaky bacon. You know what I mean? Oh, I like it. Uh, I like the good old British back bacon. But yeah, you can tell quality when it's quality and that was quality. And that's why my scrambled egg was off the charts. Now I gave it a 10, right? And you're gonna get some people say it didn't deserve a 10, but I've, it, I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not judging it on a full English. So I think it deserves a 10 because of the quality of food. Yeah, I, um, I concur. No, I like that, yeah, brilliant. Yeah. Well, make sure you subscribe to this guy who will be, who will, who will be on the end. And also, make sure you subscribe to me. There's always a bike. Get an electric bike, mate. It's a lot quieter. Anyway, that's all from me today. It's all from Darren John. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Yeah, thumbs up as well. Oh, and by the way, subscription's free. I got my sister last night. She went, oh, I'd subscribe to you, bud. How much does it cost? I went, it doesn't cost anything. Should be called something else, shouldn't it? Not subscription. Yeah, but yeah, because yeah, sub subscription doesn't cost you a bean. Don't cost you a Heinz bean. That's all from me today. We're going to get back on the on your bike. I'm going to try and catch him up now. See you later. We haven't done the song yet. You're in London. What's that? Oh, it's a good life on the buses. <laughs> Very well done, that one. That's better. <laughs> I have your job for that one, better. <laughs> <laughs>